All right, guys, so I'm at the point where I am just too sick of working from home. Like, I've been doing this for a week now. I thought it was gonna be all amazing, but it's not all it's cracked up to be, definitely not. Anyway, a couple things I wanna talk about because there's been a few changes that have been going on in kind of the ticketing world these days. So one, what happens when you've sold your tickets? And two, what's going on with postponed events, canceled events, rescheduled events? What's going on with all these things? Let's discuss. I have definitely forgotten how to ride on this thing. Not safe. Selling tickets on Ticketmaster, on StubHub, Vivid Seats, anywhere. What's going on? Basically, with all the doom and gloom that is going on in the world these days, there have been a few significant, I would say, very significant changes that have happened. And every ticket exchange is slightly, slightly different. But overall, they have the same message. Anything that you sold already, you're not going to get paid for it until the event actually happens. Nobody knows when all these rescheduled and postponed events are actually going to take place. So it's in everyone's best interest that you don't get paid until the event actually takes place. Tickets are delivered. People attend the event so you can actually go ahead and get some money. Where are the carrots? All right, so what about canceled events? So now there's two different categories. Ones that you've delivered and got paid for already and others that you have not. So if you haven't delivered the tickets yet, obviously don't go ahead and do it because the tickets are basically useless at this point. The event that's been canceled, you're not gonna get paid for it. You're getting money back from the box office. So obviously if you try and deliver these tickets, nothing's gonna happen because you can't, events not happening, won't get paid, won't get any money, all is well. Now on the flip side, and the much more scarier version is if you actually, oops, try not to die here. Bit concerned when, uh, when we have those uh, big ridges. Anyway, more importantly, what happens if you've sold tickets to an event that you've already delivered and now the events get can got canceled? No, you've already delivered the tickets, you already got paid for the tickets, uh, and now the event you find out is canceled, what's gonna happen to you? Not good things. You're gonna have to basically pay back the amounts that you've been you know, already collected. You don't get to keep that money, it's not yours, the event doesn't exist anymore, therefore the person who bought those tickets from you, they're gonna get their refund back, and they're gonna get their refund back from you. That's right, you. You are gonna pay them all their money back. So what does that mean for you? Does it mean you're out thousands and thousands of dollars for whatever you sold the tickets for? Not quite. One, yes, you are paying back the money that you already collected, so obviously that's gonna be a hole in your pocket. And unfortunately, when you have a positive sale where you've made a lot of money, it means you're gonna end up back at zero. At least from the box office point of view, you're able to get your money back that way for the actual ticket purchase, so in the end, you should be made whole. But unfortunately, being made whole is not as good as being up you know, hundreds or potentially thousands of dollars. So what does this all mean? Basically means that you are in a position where you're now basically stuck. You aren't sure what's gonna sell right now. Obviously nothing is really selling at this point. Everyone is very concerned about all the things that are happening in the world. So you're not gonna be seeing any new sales coming through. And then on top of that, in all the ticket exchanges, they're not actually gonna be paying you anything now until the events actually take place. And that's really a scary position to be in because if you have events that you've already delivered tickets for but just haven't been paid yet, fortunately it means you're not going to get any money for the next foreseeable future. You know, Subhub initially said that they weren't going to be paying out any events unless they took place after June 30th, but they've actually since cancelled that and made a change to say they're not paying out at all until events actually take place. Other resale websites are kind of doing something very similar. They're not going to pay out until the events actually take place. So again, you're stuck in this, this position of not not having enough cash to pay your bills, your expenses, your life. It's very, very tough. So what can you do? There's not a whole lot. The most important thing is don't go ahead and start delivering tickets until the last possible moment at this point because you're not gonna get paid until the events actually take place. There's gonna be a lot of changes coming up in the near future as well. So it's just because an event still has an event date set does not mean that that date is going to be the actual one that will be taking place in the future. Specifically, you know, with baseball, they're pushing back dates all the way until mid-May at the earliest. We don't know what the schedule is gonna be. NBA, NHL, these leagues, all these other other sports leagues, no one really knows when these dates are going to take place. Any types of concerts that are going on, we don't know if they're going to take place. Even with rescheduled dates and postponed dates, uh, we just we just don't know. There's too many things that have to that have to happen for everything to work out perfectly. So again, just sit 
I don't be delivering anything until you know the final, final answers from the box office, from the resale markets, from everyone. You just basically, we're just in a position where we don't have enough information. So your best case here is just to be patient, just to wait. And once we start getting more information, more details on when events are actually happening, that's when you should go ahead, start delivering those tickets. And then you will see that you're gonna start getting paid those big bucks. Yes. All in all, don't panic, just be patient. Don't be expecting to be paid though anytime soon. Again, gotta wait till those events take place. That's when you're gonna start seeing your money. If you sold events already, you're gonna get paid much, much later. If you sold events that have been canceled, you're gonna have to pay that back. And if you sold events that have been canceled that you have not yet delivered, nothing to worry about. Just make sure you go back to the box office, collect that cancellation money. One wheel ride is over. I am back home. Carrots are in my backpack. Dinner is about to start. Lots of fun things are going on. If you are interested in learning more about tickets though, be sure to subscribe on this channel because lots and lots of fun stuff is always around the corner. My name's Shiraz here on Thumbs Up Run where we talk about buying tickets, selling tickets, and making sure that you have all the fun with your tickets. That's all I got. And see you guys next time.